awesome is coming. Two eclipses of the sun will cross the U.S. in October of 2023 and April of 2024. Everyone in North America will be able to see at least part of the sun covered up by the moon. The first eclipse will be an annular or ring of fire eclipse, and the second one an awesome total eclipse of the sun. I'm astronomer Doug Duncan. I have been chasing eclipses my whole career. And I'm astronomer Jimmy Negus, and I saw my first total solar eclipse in 2017. We are here to show you how to watch an eclipse safely. In 2023, no one will see a total eclipse. That's because the moon's orbit around the Earth is not a perfect circle. It's a little bit oval. And that means the moon can be a little bit further away or a little bit closer. And of course, that means the moon will look a little smaller or a little bigger. And in October 2023, it's going to be a little smaller, so it can't completely cover the sun, no matter where you are looking. There'll be a ring of fire all the way around, and that ring will be blindingly bright. And so to watch the annular eclipse, you'll need eye protection the whole time. If you want to look at the sun, you must, must, must protect your eyes. These are not sunglasses. They're a thousand times darker, and they're made for looking at the sun. Tens of millions of people have used these to safely watch eclipses. And if you don't have eclipse glasses, you can use a pinhole camera. Let light through any small hole, and you'll be able to see an image of the sun. In fact, sometimes even the leaves of trees will let the light filter through and you see little crescents of the eclipse on the ground. And I'm sure many of you would like to photograph the event, so be sure to get a solar filter for your cameras as well. Here's a map showing how much of the sun will be covered based on where you live. No matter where you are, though, be prepared for a day in the sun with sunblock, shade, and water. Then you're ready to see the Ring of Fire Eclipse illuminate the landscape. 